morning everybody I'm off to train for something new today a new position not sure what to expect yet but I'm expecting to have fun how about that it's gonna be fun let me get my Timmy's first and we'll talk more Can I get a medium coffee with one cream? Okay. And a, uh, a sausage biscuit, please? Okay. Do you know how much more clothes am I going to build? Sure. Sure, we'll do anything else. That's it. That's what I need, thank you. Super duper. I'm excited. Yeah, so uh, like I was saying, I don't know what to expect today really, but uh, I am expecting to have fun. It's always fun learning new things, and it's also fun driving trucks, so double whammy. So it has been brought to my attention that I am extremely weird for saying super duper all the time. Yeah, I know. At least I know it, right? Crazy people don't know they're crazy. I know I'm crazy. On debit. Okay. Oh, is there a sausage biscuit in there too? Oh, yeah, you're my <laughs> Thank you. They almost forgot my biscuit. I'll forgive them, it's early. Oh, it looks like we're going to be getting up early from now on. This is going to be our life now. Okay, everybody's coming into Tim's. Everybody's coming into Tim's. All right. Gotcha. Off we go. Oh, red light. No, never mind. Biscuit and my hash brown. It smells good in here. gonna be a good day right it's going to be it's gonna be a really good day do you say going to or gonna it sounds weird when I say it's going to be a good day I would say it's gonna be a good day gonna g-o-n-n-a gonna that means going to gonna it's actually a word it's in the dictionary I think right if you google it it's there I'm not that crazy I know I'm crazy that means that means I'm not crazy I don't know. People got to learn to have fun in life. Try to make people laugh a little bit. Don't be so serious all the time. Talk to Josh, why do you say super duper? That is so weird. Among other things that they've called me. <laughs> I got a good chuckle out of that. I don't know. Man, people got to lighten up a bit. It's going to be a good day. But like I said, I have no idea what's even on the agenda today. Am I just going to be in, like, I, I did it again. Am I just going to be? Am I just gonna be in orientation all day in the office or inside? Am I gonna be driving around? I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have a trainer that's training me on this new stuff. Are we gonna go and like pick stuff up, drop it off? Or are we just gonna go over all the basics and then pick stuff up, pick stuff up, drop stuff off tomorrow? All right, your guess is as good as mine. No idea. All I know is I'm gonna be focused, laser focused on what they're telling me to do because I wanna learn as fast as possible. I don't wanna be a slow learner. But at the same time, you don't wanna miss anything, right? <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little bit nervous. I hope they like me. I hope I do good. No, I'm going to do good. I just hope they like me. That's the proper way to say that sentence. So I'm excited, nervous, and also confident. Change is always a big deal for me. I don't know. I like, you know, conserving things, keeping things the same. If they worked, Let's stick with that, right? But sometimes in life, sometimes you need to change things up. Sometimes change is good. And 
this case, I think change will be good. Hey, because I know that whatever happens today, tonight, I get to go home, sleep in my own bed. That change is already good. Well, here we are. Wish me luck. Talk to you later. Well, we went to work in the dark and we're going home in the dark. What a fun day. It was an 11 hour day. Uh, so long hours, but uh, I feel like it went well. I'm on my way home now. And uh, I want to focus on what I was being taught while I'm training. So I wasn't able to talk to you guys very much, well, at all during the day. Hopefully that'll change in the coming days or coming weeks, but we'll see. Play one day at a time here. Uh, I still have training tomorrow, Friday, Monday, and Tuesday. And uh, we'll see where we're at at the end of those days. I think that's the message that we both mutually agreed on, uh, them and I. You know, we're going to give it five days of training, and we'll see if I'm a fit for the role. If they like me, if I like them. So far, I like them very much. It's all the people there. Great. Again, you know, I did my homework before I even got into this. I, I, I made sure that wherever I go and wherever I spend the majority of my days, I wanted to be with a group of people that I like. And so far, I found two places like that so far. And uh, either one I'd love to work at. Either one. A lot of good people in this world. You just Sometimes you got to find them and sometimes they just sort of bump right into you. <laughs> like I said, we'll see. Uh, I'm going to give it the five days and we'll see. But uh, I'm liking it. I, I really liked it. Diesel. Diesel. Chevy. Ow! <laughs> you didn't hurt me, buddy. Yeah, I'm back home, and guess what came in the mail for me today? While I was at work, making the moolah. This is what I got for Christmas. Ooh, fancy. Isn't it? It is. Isn't it? Because you killed your other one. I did. I plugged the other one into a 220 outlet. Don't do that. It, it spins faster. It does. It works for that, but it also burns out your saw. I wasn't trying to do either. I didn't know it was a 220 <laughs> So I got a new one. So that was here today. Uh, it was a, an 11 hour day. Uh, didn't do any filming while I was there. Like I said, focusing on training and uh, just learning the ropes. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Okay, we'll see what happens tomorrow. We'll take it day by day. My wife, on the other hand, has been extremely busy. Well. We'll call her the Grinch. Hey! No, it just didn't feel like Christmas this year, so I want to get excited about it next year. So I took it down early. There's no more Christmas tree! All we got left is the lights on the outside of the house. Yeah, that's my job, and they're staying up. Because I r truly love Christmas, unlike that's some people. Fired. See, I'll show you a little sneak peek. Oh, there they are. There they are. You can't see it all, but that's a little sneak peek. I, uh, I'll take them down in spring once it gets uh, a little warmer. I did turn them off already. Somebody turned them back on. Well, because it's really dark in that backyard, so it helps. It's dark in the backyard, and uh, if I turn this off and take you back here, you can see that the Christmas lights go all the way around the back. And it lights up the yard so we can see the dogs. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to get a strand of some of the super bright white lights and run them along the top of the fence and just keep them there year round. And then next year we can work them into our Christmas decorations or whatever and, and uh, it'll work just great, right? But yeah, I'm sure you have lots of questions and stuff. Maybe we'll do a live stream. Later on, we'll see. Uh, this weekend, I'll probably do a live stream. 
uh, it went really well. I had a, a really good experience today, and uh, we're going back tomorrow. So it's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then Monday, Tuesday next week. And uh, we'll see what happens. We're pulling around the Super B trains. That's what they call them, the Super B trains. Because only super truckers can pull them. Right, babe? She totally agrees. Don't make me lose respect for you. No husband of mine will be a super trucker. You can call me Super B Trucker. Super Trucker B. Super B Train Trucker. I'll start calling you Billy. Billy Big Rig. If the shoe fits. It's the ultimate trucker insult. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get the hang of them pretty quick. I'm not too not too concerned about it we'll see what happens so i'll talk to you guys tomorrow and uh see what we come up with for that thanks for checking in today and we'll have a little bit more of a vlog for you tomorrow and possibly a live stream but we may do that on the weekend i'm gonna leave you in suspense <laughs>